You have no idea how much I was looking forward to those waffles. Hey, what do you hear? What do you say? My Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, your sister's ass upon Express. Very ticked off Vic here. Uh, I'm more ticked off on the inside because it's too early to be ticked off because I got to conserve my voice. I had a great show last night uh, at the Edmond Town Hall in Newtown, Connecticut. Sold out show, standing ovation. I did an hour and a half. I got to conserve the voice for tonight. And uh, I'm doing a show, another sold out show at Nucci's in Bristol, Connecticut. So I got to conserve the voice. That's why I didn't, it didn't pay to go back and forth. So I'm staying at a, you know, a, a simple, clean, nice Holiday Inn Express. I told my manager, as long as it's got a complimentary breakfast and a gym, that's all I need. I don't need a five-star hotel because the complimentary breakfast has my favorite, that, that waffle machine where you, you pour the batter in a little cup and you pour it in a waffle machine and you close it and you turn it and you wait a couple minutes. I love, there's something about... Uh, the waffles at the Holiday Inn Express. I can't explain it. Hey, look, we all have our quirks. Anyway, long story short, I go to the lobby, and naturally there's a there's a line because when people have free, they get like savages, you know. Now I see the Von Trapp family from Sound of Music. They're online, and they're right behind the Brady Bunch. So now I'm waiting on a line, you know, like they're giving out cheese. But I'm looking ahead, I'm looking at the waffle machine, and as I get closer, I see there's a note. I'm like, here we go. I get even closer, and it says, out of order. You have no idea how much I was looking forward to those waffles. Now I went from comedy to tragedy. I'm, I'm, it hit me like a ton of bricks. I just sat there, and it, it just ruined my whole, my whole psyche. I took a couple of breaths. I said, well, what do I do? Do you want the powdered eggs? Or I'm, I'm, not, I'm watching a lady in the corner breastfeeding a kid. Hey, folks, I know it's a beautiful thing, but I, there's something about watching a lady breastfeed a kid as you're pouring half and half. So I thought to myself, holy shit, wait a minute. I pasted Dunkin' Donuts on the way here. It's right up the road. Fuck it. I don't care if I pay a couple of dollars for coffee. What the who gives it? The coffee and, and the complimentary breakfast was warm. Was warm. It's got my coffee has to be hot and it tasted like shit. It was burnt. I I took a sip and just threw it down the the, uh, the into the garbage pail. So I got in the car, went to Dunkin' Donuts. Beautiful. Nobody on the on the drive through line. I'm the only one. Here we go. It was meant to be. Hey, maybe it was meant to be that I have the waffles. I'm gonna eat healthy. I'm gonna get the, the oatmeal. Dunkin' Donuts is great oatmeal. You know, so I get to the, the speak, I ask the mutant, yeah, let me get a, a small hot coffee, cream and sugar, and the uh, oatmeal with all the toppings, you know, on the side, with, they come to the plastic bag, the almonds, the raisins, the nuts, beautiful, you open it up, you pour it in, so I pull up, give the guy the money, thank you, buddy, you got everything here, you got a napkin, you know, we're all set, yeah, okay, look, the coffee, I take a sip before, I always to check before I pull out, it was perfect, the guy nailed it, it was perfectly made. I checked for the oatmeal. Okay, we got the oatmeal, napkins. Nice. Thank you, pal. Gave him a $2, $2 tip. All right. Pulled away. Right, so let me pull over here. Let me pull over before I go back to the hotel. I found a nice spot to pull over because I was starving. I take a sip of my coffee again. Nice. I opened the oatmeal. Got a napkin. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? There's no spoon! The mutant, they give, they give me a spoon. Now Now I'm halfway between Dunkin' Donuts and the Holiday Inn Express. Do I go back to Dunkin' Donuts or the drive for like an ass or can I, you forgot the spoon. I, I, there's probably a line now. If I go to, to, the, to the, back to the complimentary breakfast, the, the, the Von Trapp family and the Brady Bunch probably went up for seconds to take me an hour to get a fucking spoon. So I sat in the car eating my oatmeal like a fucking Ethiopian. That's what ticks me off.